Have you ever seen a sea turtle illuminating the ocean's dark depths? If not, then you might be unaware of the incredible diversity of turtles seen in nature. From dinosaur-like creatures to a turtle that has two heads, get ready to be amazed by their unique appearances, behaviors, and fascinating stories that will defy your wildest imagination. Join us as we will take you on an exciting adventure with 15 turtles that you won't believe actually exist. Number 15. Janus, the Two-Headed Turtle Janus, the world's oldest two-headed tortoise, is an extraordinary creature. With two heads, two hearts, and two pairs of lungs, he truly stands out from other tortoises. Janus belongs to the species Testudo Graeca, commonly known as the Greek tortoise. He has been a resident of the Geneva Natural History Museum since his birth in 1997. However, his distinct appearance has made him famous on the internet, captivating people with his remarkable double-headed presence. The best part is that Janus has two different personalities, each associated with one head. The right head is more curious and awake, exhibiting a strong personality, while the left head is more passive and loves to eat. Despite having two heads, Janus has only one digestive system, which requires special attention from his caregivers. Janus leads a specially curated lifestyle under the care of dedicated professionals. His diet consists of organic fruits and vegetables, with his caregivers ensuring that he receives a balanced and nutritious diet. But Janus can be a picky eater. It has different preferences for each head. The luxurious life of Janus doesn't end here. To maintain his well-being, Janus receives daily massages and baths in green tea and chamomile, a unique routine designed to keep his skin healthy. He even goes for regular walks. Not only this, his caregivers provide him with personalized attention, playing music each morning to help him wake up and engage in regular conversations. It seems as if Janus is cared for like a little baby. Sadly, poor Janus did suffer from a large bladder stone, which was later removed successfully through surgery. Now, who wouldn't want to safeguard such an incredible creature for generations to come? Number 14. The Glowing Biofluorescent Turtle Deep beneath the ocean's surface, there is a turtle that can glow like a torch. This remarkable discovery off the coast of the Solomon Islands happened when a group of divers set out near the Solomon Islands, equipped with their cameras and a sense of adventure. Their goal was to capture footage of biofluorescent marine creatures, particularly sharks. Little did they know that their expedition would lead them to a breathtaking encounter with a glowing hawksbill sea turtle. The hawksbill sea turtles are an endangered species known scientifically as Eretmochalus imbricate. One of their kind emerged from the darkness in front of the divers. This majestic creature exhibited an astonishing display of colors, glowing bright red and green under their blue lights. The divers were amazed as they followed the turtle, filming its every move. The encounter was brief, but it left a lasting impression. David Gruber, an associate professor of biology at Baruch College, was thrilled to witness this phenomenon on camera. There are previous studies on biofluorescence in loggerhead sea turtles, but only in captivity. This discovery was a significant breakthrough in scientific research because it marked the first ever biofluorescence to be observed in a wild reptile. Number 13. Alligator Snapping Turtle The alligator snapping turtle, with their dinosaur-like appearance, have earned their place in the natural history books. These turtles belong to the genus Macrochelus, which includes just one species, Macrochelus taminki. It is a member of the Chelidridae family, commonly known as the snapping turtles. However, they are considered a living fossil and are often linked to a dinosaur. It's not hard to see why. With its spiky shell and dinosaur-like face, this turtle displays an ancient look. It has three pointed ridges that run from its head to tail, giving it a unique appearance. Unlike other species of snapping turtles, the alligator snapping turtle has eyes positioned on the sides of its head, enhancing its overall dinosaur-like appearance. This remarkable creature possesses a large head with strong jaws and a hooked beak. Its dark brown shell provides excellent camouflage among the muddy riverbeds. Having a long, narrow tongue with an appendage that resembles a worm, it lures the prey closer to its powerful jaws. They have a bite force of up to 1,000 pounds, capable of snapping through bone. Another amazing ability is their capacity to hold their breath for an astonishing 40 to 50 minutes, allowing them to patiently wait for their prey in the water. These turtles are primarily carnivorous with a diet consisting of fish and other aquatic animals. The alligator snapping turtles are distributed exclusively in the United States, specifically in the southeastern region. They prefer aquatic habitats and rarely visit the land. You can find them in the deeper beds of freshwater bodies. Number 12. The Eastern Snake-Necked Turtle 
The eastern snake-necked turtle looks like it belongs to a yoga class. Known as the common or eastern long-necked turtle, this semi-aquatic turtle is found in southeastern Australia. They get their name from the long and narrow neck that can be more than half the length of its shell. Measuring up to 11 inches in length, the eastern snake-necked turtle's remarkable neck sets it apart from other turtle species. Its shell is broad, flattened, and oval-shaped, ranging in color from light brown to black. The head, neck, and limbs are typically dark gray or brown, while the underside exhibits a cream or yellow color. You can see how it's equipped with webbed feet and claws, enabling it to swim and dig. Being natives to southeastern Australia, they can be found in the Murray-Darling Basin. As freshwater turtles, they inhabit streams, rivers, swamps, and wetlands. Their semi-aquatic nature allows them to live comfortably in both aquatic and terrestrial environments. Despite being semi-aquatic, these turtles spend most of their time at the bottom of the water bodies. They can be found burrowing into fallen leaves on the forest floor during periods of extreme heat or drought. Their state of dormancy remains until rainfall returns. Turns. When it comes to their diet, eastern snake-necked turtles are carnivorous. They prey on a variety of aquatic species, but they may also consume terrestrial insects. An eastern snake-necked turtle can live for several decades. Some individuals can also reach ages of over 30 years. So next time you get scared at the sight of what you thought was a snake, remember, it could be a clever eastern snake-necked turtle trying to scare you off. Number 11. Cantor's Giant Softshell Turtle a big mass of jelly, the Cantor's giant softshell turtle, a remarkable species, combines the features of both turtles and frogs. It belongs to the family Trionychidae, also known as the softshell turtles. These are also famous as the frog-faced softshell turtle. With a flattened head and widely spaced eyes on top of its head, this turtle bears a lot of resemblance to frogs. The shell of the Cantor's giant softshell turtle is smooth and flat, lacking the rigid scutes found in other turtle species. But this adaptation comes with the advantage of moving effortlessly in the water. This species is considered to be among the largest freshwater turtles in existence. Adult individuals can reach impressive weights, with males weighing up to 200 pounds and females weighing even more. They are true giants of the turtle world. These fascinating turtles can be found in various regions of Southeast Asia. They inhabit slow-moving freshwater bodies and live a unique lifestyle mostly buried in the sand, remaining motionless and hidden from sight. Only their eyes and mouth protrude from the sand as they lie in wait for their prey. These turtles surface only twice a day to take a breath and surprise their prey with lightning-fast attacks. As primarily carnivorous creatures, Cantor's giant softshell turtles feed on fish, crustaceans, and mollusks. They are skilled predators, utilizing their hunting tactics to catch their prey. With their flattened head and widely spaced eyes, they can thrust their head and neck forward with their mouth wide open, creating a sudden burst of suction. This swallows water with explosive speed, capturing their prey too. Sadly, the Cantor's giant softshell turtle is critically endangered and is disappearing from their natural habitats. Number 10. Razorback Musk Turtle The Razorback Musk Turtle is often kept as a pet, but this unique creature isn't ordinary at all. You might wonder why it's called Razorback? Well, it is its sharp keel running down the center of its shell, giving it an iconic Razorback look. However, you can identify it by its brown upper shell, with black markings along the edges of each skute. To add an extra touch of creativity, their gray-brown skin is also marked with black spotting. Not to forget, their bulbous head, long neck, and short legs make them look like little rebels. Do you know why they are called musk? Wait till they sense a threat and release a foul musky odor. These are true ninja turtles when it comes to fighting off predators. Belonging to the family Kinosternidae, this species is a native to the southern United States. You can find them in states like Oklahoma, Arkansas, Mississippi, Texas, Louisiana, and even Florida. They have adapted to the freshwater environments, preferring slow-moving waters with soft bottoms and abundant aquatic vegetation. They thrive in places where they can find plenty of hiding spots and suitable basking sites. Soaking up its warmth while showcasing their shells is also important to them. When it comes to their diet, razorback musk turtles are carnivorous creatures. They have a diverse palate, feasting on aquatic invertebrates like crayfish, freshwater clams, snails, and various insects. But their taste for adventure doesn't stop there. They also indulge in fish and even carrion. These turtles are known to be skilled hunters, using their sharp beak to capture their prey and satisfy their appetite. While the razorback musk turtles is not currently listed as endangered, they face challenges in its natural habitat. Number 9. 
the Mata Mata Turtle. This might be the strangest turtle you have ever seen. The Mata Mata Turtle is a reptile dwelling in the depths of South America's vibrant landscapes. This freshwater species is found in the lush Amazon and Orinoco basins. These incredible turtles have claimed their domain across South America, from Venezuela and Brazil to Peru, Ecuador, Colombia, Bolivia, and even the island of Trinidad. But what features truly make it so captivating? Its triangular head with tubercles and flaps of skin, and a long, tubular snout bearing resemblance to a mystical horn. Its rough and knobby carapace has spherical cones, ranging from black to brown in color. It also displays hues of cream, yellow, and brown. With their wide, flattened neck covered in warts, skin fringes, and ridges, the Mata Matas are nature's living masterpieces. Furthermore, these turtles can be as long as 45 centimeters in shell length and weigh up to 38 pounds. You can find them in the slow-moving blackwater streams as they prefer soft, muddy bottoms where they skillfully navigate the shallow waters. Despite having an aquatic nature, these turtles aren't well adapted to swimming in open water bodies. However, their hunting technique is truly captivating. Being carnivores, they remain motionless, blending into their surroundings. These turtles lure their prey closer, and with a powerful suction, they engulf their meals whole. Being nocturnal hunters, they rely on their remarkable night vision to detect movements in the murky waters. Having poor eyesight, they compensate remarkably by relying on their unique sensory adaptations, such as skin flaps, tubercles, and barbels, allowing them to detect nearby movements in the murky depths. Number 8. Jonathan, Seychelles Giant Tortoise. You won't believe us if we tell you how old Jonathan, the legendary tortoise, is. At an unbelievable 190 years old, he has a truly extraordinary story. Jonathan, a Seychelles giant tortoise, holds the title for being the oldest known living land animal on our planet. But how did he end up becoming so famous? Well, it all began when Jonathan found his forever home on the beautiful island of Helena where he was presented to the governor as a gift. Sadly, with old age comes the various health problems, and Jonathan faced his fair share of them. With the advancing years, he ended up with a blunt, crumbly beak and was unable to graze. However, a veterinarian came quickly to its rescue. The care and attention provided to Jonathan allowed him to make a remarkable recovery. Now, Jonathan is seen spending his days leisurely sunbathing, enjoying the warmth of the tropical sun. And when it comes to his diet, this fascinating tortoise has quite an appetite. He indulges in leafy greens, succulent fruits, and even the occasional hibiscus flower. With a shell that spans over three feet and a fascinating blend of dark brown and golden hues, he truly is one of its kind. Oh, and let's not forget his weight. This tortoise shouldn't be taken lightly. It weighs almost 200 kilograms. Despite his unbelievable longevity, people are prepared for the inevitable. Sadly, even for such an icon, life will surely follow its natural course. Number 7. The Mary River Turtle Endemic to the Mary River in Queensland, Australia the Mary River Turtle is one of Australia's largest turtles. Their elongated, streamlined carapace can range in color from rusty red to brown and almost black. But what makes this turtle truly stand out is its distinctive green, hair-like strands of algae that cover its shell, giving it an eye-catching appearance. The underside of their shell varies from cream to pale pink. With its unique look, it's no wonder that the Mary River Turtle has captured the attention of people on the Internet. The Mary River Turtle belongs to the genus Eleuser, and it is the only species within its genus. This fascinating turtle has a long evolutionary history, diverging from all other living species around 40 million years ago. These turtles prefer clear, well-oxygenated, slow-flowing streams, often residing in shallow waters. This provides them with the perfect environment to thrive in. These aquatic creatures spend most of their time in the water, hence, they are powerful swimmers, capable of staying submerged for up to three days. Their unique bimodal respiration capability gives them the name bum-breathing turtles because they can absorb oxygen through their cloaca while staying underwater. However, they still need to come to the surface regularly to breathe air in the usual way. If you are wondering what they eat, being omnivorous, these turtles enjoy a varied menu that includes algae, bivalves, fish, frogs, and even the occasional duckling. Furthermore, the Mary River turtles like to stay alone unless they wish to mate. One needs to stay cautious of their aggressive nature. It's better not to disturb them at all. Despite being classified as endangered, these turtles are popular pets in Australia. You might know them by the name of Penny Turtle or Pet Shop Turtle. Number 6. 
the leopard tortoise. The leopard tortoise gets its name from the beautiful and intricate patterns on its shell. It belongs to the genus Stigmachelis, making it the only member of this genus. It is the fourth largest tortoise species in the world. The leopard tortoise's shell pattern is not only attractive, but also provides perfect camouflage in its natural habitat. These tortoises have a domed shell that is brownish or yellowish, having dark patches that resemble the spots of a leopard. The shell is hard, providing excellent protection for the tortoise. Leopard tortoises are native to the savannas of eastern and southern Africa. They can be found in countries ranging from Sudan in the north to the southern Cape in the south. This species thrives in semi-arid to grassland habitats, favoring areas with a mixture of grasses and vegetation. You can find them in the hot and dry savannas of Africa, where they have evolved to cope with the challenging climate. Like camels, these tortoises can store water in their specialized bursa sac. The leopard tortoise is a grazing species making use of the abundant grasses in its habitat. They are also observed grazing on succulents, flowers, fungi, berries, and various fruits. Occasionally, they may also consume ash or old bones, possibly to supplement their calcium levels. Being predominantly terrestrial, they spend most of their time on land. However, in extremely hot or cold weather, they may seek refuge in abandoned fox and jackal holes. But these tortoises, despite being terrestrial, display a remarkable ability of staying underwater for up to 10 minutes. The leopard tortoise is considered common and widespread. However, these tortoises play an important role in their ecosystem as seed dispersers. Hence, they should be protected at all costs. Now, it's time for today's subscriber pick. Here's a picture showing a huge turtle being transported on a trailer, accompanied by police. The features of the creature seem to be quite dangerous with its pointy teeth and a spiky shell. Why does it seem to be sedated and being escorted somewhere? Had it awakened from its long slumber, emerging from the depths of water ready to devour humans? Or perhaps is it a laboratory experiment gone wrong while trying to bring ancient creatures back to life? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Number 5 the pancake tortoise. Have you ever seen a turtle so flat it could be mistaken for a pancake? Well, the pancake tortoise has a shell that is unusually thin, flat, and flexible. While most other tortoises have solid structural shells, the pancake tortoise's shell is filled with holes, making it lightweight and incredibly modal. With a brown shell having vibrant yellow markings, these tortoises can blend with their rocky habitat. Their body is light brown in color, adding to their camouflage. Belonging to the family Testudinidae, the pancake tortoise is a unique species with no other members in its genus. These tortoises are native to Tanzania and Kenya in East Africa. They enjoy the arid savannas and dry grasslands. As herbivores, pancake tortoises have a diet consisting mainly of dried grasses and other vegetation. Hence, you can find them in semi-arid deserts with scarce vegetation for them to feed on. They have also been introduced to Zambia and Zimbabwe. They start their day early in the morning, emerging from their shelters to bask in the sun and find food. But summers can be hard on them. Hence, to escape the scorching sun, they may estivate or sleep beneath flattened rocks. Pancake tortoises are true masters of rock climbing. Owing to their flexible and light shells, they crawl quickly into narrow rock crevices when danger approaches. Their incredible hiding ability gives them the title of sprinters and hiders and also makes them the fastest turtles. But what if the predator tries to pull them out? Well, these turtles secure their spiky legs firmly, making it nearly impossible to dislodge them. These turtles are great gymnasts, too, as they quickly flip themselves upright if they accidentally end up on their backs. Number 4. The Painted Turtle Scientifically known as Chrysimus picta, painted turtles are a mesmerizing artistic work of nature. These turtles have long oval shells with smooth surfaces and grooves where the scale-like plates overlap. Their top shell ranges in color from olive to black, while the bottom shell is typically yellow, sometimes with reddish hues and markings. But it's their exquisite markings on their skin that steal the show. With red and yellow stripes on their necks, legs, and tails, these turtles seem like they have been painted by someone. Their heads are equally captivating, featuring yellow stripes, large yellow spots behind the eyes, and distinctive yellow chin stripes. Belonging to the family Emidaidae, the painted turtles are native to North America. They have an incredibly vast distribution. These turtles are the only ones whose range spans the entire continent. Painted turtles are true water enthusiasts, thriving in freshwater habitats with soft bottoms, basking spots, and abundant aquatic vegetation. 
You can spot them in creeks, marshes, ponds, rivers, and the shores of lakes. These social creatures enjoy their get-together sessions. You can spot more than 50 individuals basking together on a single log. After emerging from the water at sunrise, they soak up the warmth for several hours together before returning to the water for food. They follow this cycle of basking and feeding throughout the day, a routine we all desire, don't we? As true omnivores, they enjoy a varied diet, feasting on both animals and plants. Aquatic insects, fish, crustaceans, aquatic vegetation, and algae all make their way onto the painted turtle's menu. But what is truly unbelievable about these painted turtles is that their fossils show that they have been on the Earth for around 15 million years. Number three, Diego, savior of his species. Do you know how an incredible tortoise single-handedly saved his entire species from extinction? Meet Diego, a true hero among tortoises, one for the history books. Diego became a global sensation owing to its extraordinary breeding abilities that helped him successfully repopulate his endangered species. But let's start from the beginning. Diego's life was always adventurous. He was taken away from his home island in the 1930s and for decades, he resided in zoos, first in New York and then in California. But his sad days came to an end when he caught the attention of researchers and conservationists. Recognizing his valuable role in species preservation, Diego was transferred to a captive breeding center on Santa Cruz Island in the early 1970s. There, he began a mission that changed the course of his species' fate forever. Diego's commitment to fatherhood was unmatched. He tirelessly contributed to the breeding program, fathering thousands of baby tortoises. His efforts reversed the decline of his species, but the story doesn't end there. In June 2020, after years of fostering generations of offspring, Diego finally returned home to Espanola Island. Reunited with his many descendants, he now roams freely in the wild. Despite his age of 150 years, Diego is incredibly mobile. He spends the dry season saving his energy, while in the wet season, he actively seeks and replenishes his nutritional reserves. Diego can be found around his home near the cactus trees and wanders to find occasional fruits and water. His short exploration trips lead him to tortoise rocks, where he can quench his thirst during brief mists. What remains extraordinary about Diego is that he asserts his dominance over other male tortoises, but welcomes any females who seek his companionship. Does this mean more of his kind are incoming? Number two, the yellow blotched map turtle. The yellow blotched map. Turtles are now quite famous on the internet as their unique characteristics have captivated people. These turtles belong to the Imididae family and are a part of the narrow-headed group of map turtles. This species, scientifically known as Graptomys flavimaculata, is endemic to the southern United States, specifically the Pascagoula River in Mississippi and its tributaries. Their range extends to within 8.4 miles of the river's mouth, making it a relatively confined habitat. The males of this species reach a carapace length of about 3.5 to 4.5 inches, while the females grow larger. The yellow-blotched map turtle has the highest central keel among all map turtles, giving them a distinct look. Speaking of habitat, these turtles prefer medium to large rivers with an open canopy, allowing plenty of sunlight for basking and are often found near logs. They can also inhabit creeks, especially those with bends that resemble larger river habitats. Being an opportunistic feeder, they primarily consume insects. However, they also enjoy crustaceans, fish, and even some plant matter. It's fascinating how they adapt their diet to what's available in their surroundings. Let's not forget their unique behavior. The yellow-blotched map turtle are diurnal, and they are seen spending most of their time basking, even during rain showers or cooler temperatures. However, they have a very cautious nature. They mostly stick to one side of their river habitat and occasionally venture to the other side. So if you desire to have a look at these yellow-blotched map turtles, you know where to find them exactly. Number one, the pig-nosed turtle from the dinosaur era. The pig-nosed turtle is a unique blend of both the turtle and a pig. But another fact about this turtle is bound to fascinate you more. This turtle dates back to the time of dinosaurs. Yes, you heard it right. The pig-nosed turtle, scientifically known as Coreticellus in Sculpta, is the only member of its family and genus. This unique species falls under the category of soft-shell turtles. Their family lineage dates back an astonishing 140 million years, making it older than many of the dinosaurs that once roamed the Earth. This freshwater turtle is also known as the pitted-shelled turtle, or fly river turtle. Despite their freshwater habitat, these are the only freshwater turtles to possess marine flippers. These turtles don't swim, but instead 
use their paddle-like flippers to row through the water. The pig-nosed turtle can be identified by their domed bony carapace, which has a leathery texture, exhibiting shades of gray or olive. On the other hand, its lower shell is cream-colored. Growing to an average length of 28 to 30 inches and weighing over 44 pounds, the pig-nosed turtle is an incredible creature. It is found in specific regions of the Northern Territory of Australia and the island of New Guinea. These turtles can also breathe underwater. You can find them in warm freshwater habitats where they hide in mud, sand, loose gravel, or under submerged branches. As omnivores, they can consume a variety of plants and animals, from munching on fruits and leaves to indulging in crustaceans, mollusks, and insects. Despite being social animals, they have a reputation for being highly aggressive. Beware of entering their territory. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.